Uh, you have to check this out. Fortune magazine has just released this 18 under 18 list of the country's most innovative and ambitious teens. And check this out. And of the 18 people chosen, two of them are from right here in Memphis. That is an incredible percentage. Mosiah Bridge found, uh, Bridges, founder of Moe's Bows, and food entrepreneur Logan Gulef, the season two winner of MasterChef Junior, both just 14 years old. Two of the youngest on the list, and from right here in the Mid South, we are so excited. To yes, we be are. Able to we, say knew we knew you guys you win. forever. <laughs> So what was this like? What was your first reaction, Mo? My first reaction, it was it was just excitement because I couldn't <laughs> believe that uh, a company that highlighted successful businesses and yeah. successful people chose me from Memphis, Tennessee. It was just a very exciting feeling. Mm -hmm. Logan, what about you? I don't know. To me, it was just like great because um, Fortune kind of came to me and where I was all like, well, do you really want to do this? And I was like, of course I want to do it. I mean, it's Fortune magazine. <laughs> so I just kind of went from there and uh, I was. I'm really excited that it came out. I'm just a little wondering whether or not it'll actually be in the magazine. Oh, it better be. It better be. It better be. Online, right? So, what do you yeah. guys do with this? I mean, it, it, it's so important, obviously, to have this recognition. How do you use it? How to, from this day forth? What do you want to do? I think I just want to let people know that anybody can do anything and from me, a kid from Memphis, Tennessee, just being on the list was just an amazing thing for me and I just want to let everybody know that they can make it to where I've made it and they can be whoever they want to mm -hmm. be no matter where they come from. Yeah. What's your number one piece of advice, let's start with you Logan, oh, for someone who at the, whatever age. The number one, the number one piece of advice for someone my age who wants to get like into cooking and into stuff is just really go for it. I mean, don't be scared to just try it and really just experiment in whatever you want to do. Experiment if it's in cooking, if it's in art, mm -hmm. if it's in whatever. Just go for it. Don't be afraid. Yeah. Huh? Don't be How afraid. About you, well, for me, for business, I would say to always figure out what you like doing and find out how you can make money doing it, which was my passion was fashion. So I first started with the NC page, then I began to uh, make the bow ties, and then I sold the bow ties for bags of chips, and then now I sell them for $50. So it's just figuring, figuring out your passion and figuring out what you want to do with it. You so sold what is, them what early is, on for a it. bag of chips? Wow. Yeah. wow what, is your, what is your next passion, though? What else do you want to work My on? My next passion, of course, is going to have something to do with fashion. So it's creating blazers, creating long neck ties, and not just that, I want to do motivational speaking. I'm mm -hmm. traveling to Germany next month, so I'm just doing a bunch of things and experimenting with a bunch of clothing to see what works with my customers. To yeah. expand Logan, your what about line. you? What's about next? You, oh, next, I've got my cookbook coming out. Awesome. So it's, a, it's a brand new idea. Nothing out there like it. It's a graphic cookbook adventure. And uh, so pretty much there was this girl in Indonesia who drew me when I was on the show. And mom looked at it and she was like, man, she's pretty good at drawing. Maybe we should like get up and maybe make a story or something. And so then we figured it out. Uh, Cindy Tan, who's the uh, artist who drew all the art. And um, then we had to get like a colorist and we had to go through all of the process of like really making it happen and, and getting it has an recipes idea. in it. It, right. it, of course, I mean, it has why to. would I give you a book? So I don't get kids inspired to sure. uh, cook. Yeah, everybody yeah has it's gone um, very step by step. Very, um, the, there's a lot of photos in it, so it shows you what it should look like, and uh, that's I it. I love right. it. You guys are showing us what success looks like, mm -hmm. and we're very proud of you for Thank sure. You. Absolutely. All right. Thank you guys very much.